these can come in rapid react. For sure. Let's take a look at qualification match number two. On the Red Alliance, we've got 1690, 114, and 1678 coming up with 3310, 1700, and 2910 rounding out our Blue Alliance. I'm so excited about this alliance. 3310 hasn't been back here. They won it last time they were here. I think that was 2018, but they have one of the fastest hangers out there. Um, but 20, Jack in the Box 2910 has been one of my favorites the last few years. They fly around the the field. They are really the epitome of the modern swerve drive. Yeah, when you look at this match, both on the Red Alliance and the Blue Alliance side, you see teams that are always contenders at championship. They're mostly on Einstein. They're finalists in their division. And this is what we all come to Chessy Champs for. We're going to head back down to the field to watch match two, and we'll see you back here afterwards. Qualification match number two. Let's get these teams introduced. Starting on the Red Alliance, we have 1690. All the way from Israel, that's Orbis. Their partners, 114. From Los Altos, California, that's Eagle Strike. And around here, 1678. From Davis, California, that's Citrus Circuit. Over on blue, we have 2910. From Buttle, Washington, that's Jack in the Box. Their partner's 1700. From Palo Alto, California, that's Gator Bonnet. And all the way from the great state of Texas, it's 3310. From East Texas, that's Black Hawk Robotics. Thumbs up on our field, drivers behind the lines. One for the money, two for the show, three to get ready. Now go, go, go! I take that back, I was too enthusiastic, I apologize.
Let's try this again. I'm going to be real slow now as to not mess it up. All right. Drivers behind the lines. Wait for it. Three, two. Are we good? Are we good? One, go. Here we are at qualification match number two at Chessy Champs. There goes five blue cargo, four, five, six red cargo into that upper hub. We still got half the time left. 1678 rolling that blue cargo into their own hangar zone. Leaving the autonomous beat, it's 38 to 34. Slight advantage red, but it's still anyone's game with six amazing robots on the field here at Chessy Champ. 3310 all the way from the Red Moon Player Station, just a little bit wide. 1690, that's Orbit with one and two red cargo into that upper hub. 114 playing some defense, trying to chase down 3310, running that robot into the wall, trying to make sure they're not able to score this match. That's leaving 2910 undefended on the far side of the field, though. That little bot just zipping their way around, picking up that cargo and placing it in that upper hub. 1690 up with a few more. Looks like they're locked and loaded. That's one, that's two. Just a little bit wide for the Red Alliance. Over on blue, we've got 1700. That's Gator Botics lining up. One is a little bit short. See if they can get that second one up. On the far side of the field, we got 1670 and their robot Mergy picking up those two pieces of red cargo. They're locked, they're loaded. That's up for two for the Red Alliance. We are 93 to 69, advantage red. But we've still got over a minute left in this match, folks. It is anyone's game. Eagle Strike lining up that turret, that big green light locked and loaded on that upper hub. Can they get in position to fire off that cargo? 3310 and 2910 working together. Both blue robots on the red side of the field looking for that cargo to get up into that upper hub. 3310 up for two, 2910 up for two. 1690 just picking that red cargo up off the floor. No one's getting in their way. They can swerve right around them. Shoot on the move. Here we are at Chessy Chance. 1690 looking to line up. Up and they're good. <laughs> All right, folks, we all know that sound. That means it's time to climb. 114 up off the ground for red on the high rung. Let's see who's going up for blue. 2910 looks like they're in position. 114, can they get ready to go to the traversal rung? Let's see, they're gonna make an attempt. Hooks are going up. Look, we've got 3310 off the ground. 3310 traversal. 1678, 114 traversal. Can we get? 2910 up, yes we can! That is four robots on the traversal wrong as time expires. Your score is coming up now, and it will be the Red Alliance with a score of 191 to 139. Over to RSN to break down that match. What a phenomenal match for match number two coming out of this. This is just such a great example of the high caliber teams that we have at this event. Yeah, one of the really great things to me was the defense being played by 114. When you have a swerve drive and you're that fast and can move around the field, you can stop some of the greatest teams. So they were on 3310 so much, and that really prevented the, the Blue Alliance from scoring to their full potential. Yeah, and you know, with 3310 kind of having to maneuver that defense, uh, 2910 was on fire. They were basically undefended the whole match, and even though it was a loss, they did at least get the 40 cargo balls in, so they were able to get three RP during that match, and they still lost. Now, the Red Alliance comes away with all of the bonus RPs. I bet they're pretty happy about that. And a score of 191 is a Shocking, really right? good score in, in Rapid React, for yeah, sure. Yeah, you got to throw some reps to Orbit. I mean, they were one of the first teams this season to come out with video of shooting on the drive, and it's yep. just gotten better all season. I mean, that has pushed the limit of FRC technology this year. Yeah, absolutely. They've been a phenomenal team all year, and I, it's just so exciting to get to see them in person here at Chessy Champs. Let's take a look at qualifying.